What's going on everybody, Larry back with you. And today I wanna to talk to you guys about fitness. Now, that's a constant thing that I struggle with. I'm always trying to get in better shape. I'm always trying to eat better. And you know, I try intermediate, intermittent fasting. I try not eating carbs. I try this, I try that. And with some health issues that I have, I find it very difficult staying on a routine or staying in shape or stuff like that. Now you have things that you can use, like you have, uh, here I have my Samsung Gear 3, I think this is, this is the latest Samsung watch to come out. Um, it's off right now because it's the end of the day, but I also have used the Apple Watch in the past. And, and while these are great options, they may not be the option for everyone because they are quite expensive. So what do you do if you're looking for something where you can get good feedback, maybe your steps, your heart rate, your calories burned, things like that in maybe the same form factor as something like an Apple Watch, but with considerably less cost. Well, that's what we're gonna talk about today. I have the Tempo VT3 Plus. It's a smartwatch. Let's flip over to the overhead and let's take a look at what we get in the box and we'll put it on and we'll see what kind of features that it has. All right, so let's take a look at the Tempo VT3 Plus and what we get in here. So yeah, so this is $60 on Amazon right now. So that's a fraction of the cost of something like an Apple Watch or like I said, the Samsung uh, Gear Watch 3 or whatever. They also have a 20% off coupon that all you gotta do is click it right underneath before you add it to the cart and you're gonna get 20% off. So that's another huge bonus. That's gonna bring it down sub $50. It's got a 1.5 inch touch screen with a heart rate monitor, blood oxygen meter, it's got sleep and step tracking, IP68 waterproof, and it's compatible with iOS or Android. It has 18 exercise modes to track your training. Again, there's sleep tracking, so if you're into that, I usually don't wear mine at night, but you have notifications that you can set up for deep relax, nervous regulation, replenishing en energy, just a bunch of different things to sort of keep, your, keep you healthy and keep your mind right. Battery life, they're saying, is amazing. They're saying seven days with typical usage 15 days on standby and two hours to fully charge it. That's pretty dang good. Let's take a look here. Nice packaging. Here is the watch itself. Here is a little comment card, like if you feel good, tell some people. If you don't, tell us. Here is the charger. So the charger is USB type A with a couple magnets and a couple pins that attach, I'm guessing to the side. We'll take a look at the watch closer in a moment. We have a user manual, which is good. I think this is a fantastic gift, especially for like a kid or something that wants, to, wants a smartwatch, but you're not willing to spend you know, 300 bucks on an Apple Watch. Looks like it takes like standard watch bands. This is sort of like the setup how my Galaxy Watch is. You got like this little pin, push it back and then pull it out. Looks like your charging is right on the back. So you're just gonna slap that on and it's gonna start charging. There you can see your heart monitor and the oxygen monitor, all that good sensors and stuff on the back. Now, how well they work, I don't know. We'll, we'll We'll test it while we're sitting here, but just like any other device like this, this isn't made to be a medical device. So I wouldn't take this and just be like, oh, I'm good, I don't need to go to the doctor, even though like I'm having a chest pain because my watch says I'm okay. Get to the doctor, I mean, that's with any product. Let a professional tell you what's up, not, and not your watch. I mean, it's very Apple Watch-esque. You even have like the red little piece around the crown area. There's no other buttons but the crown. I don't see any kind of speaker or anything like that, so not sure if we got any kind of audio feedback. Okay, so we have a flashlight. Okay, it looks like you swipe up. We have whatever this is, heart rate. So you got different watch faces depending on what you what your preferences are, what you like. So there's actually quite a few. That one looks familiar. 
there's quite a few watch faces, which I'm actually sort of surprised about. I mean, it's responsive for what it is. And then over here, you can say, okay, I'm gonna go walk, I'm gonna run. Time's not set up. Let's get it set up. Let's connect it to the to my phone and see what we got with that. Okay, so once you sign up for an account, uh, male or female, so male, height and weight, birthday. It's gonna give you a suggested amount of steps, 10,000, that's usually the norm. Uh, it's your weight, your current weight is 227, your ideal weight is 148 to 227. So let's say I want to get down to about 200. I'm also not 227. Uh, calories, okay, so those are your goals. Okay, yes, while well, using the app, allow. So I want to add a watch. Looks like it sees that one already. This is where you're gonna set up all your notifications. You can add notifications. So we're connected already. Easy camera. So you get a little way to take a picture, a little shutter button on the, the actual phone. We got a firmware update, we'll do that in a little bit. Date format, unit of measure. This is a time right now. So it's got the time, but it's 24 hours, so palm gesturing. I mean, there's a lot of stuff in here. Timing out is very fast, so I'm gonna say 60 seconds for time out. Uh, we're in on my left, you have an update, vibration reminder, so we got different ways to vibrate for different stuff. Smart reminder, alarm schedule, date format, we do day month here in the US. Unit of measure is imperial because we like to be different, I guess. Others not available, can I switch units now? Okay, I wanted to make it not 24 hours. Here's a like a dashboard to show your steps, uh, it's got like, it looks like that's the stand where you gotta stand for 12 hours, your 10,000 steps and your 1,000 calorie goal. Speed walking, you can get into all your information, all your data, sleep tracking. Settings, 24 hours, turn off 24 hours. I'm gonna get my watch face to change. Oh, you gotta press and hold. Okay, that's not bad. Let's try it out. All right, so it's on, it's pretty good. Uh, maybe I would look to upgrade the band. You see it's responsive. Like when you flick your wrist, it turns on. The touch controls are really good. Like I, I honestly, my expectations were pretty low for something this inexpensive. Cause it doesn't, the tech on it, it doesn't feel cheap. I don't know, I, I think this is really cool. I mean, for the price, I think this is a fantastic option for a gift, especially for a younger person. Like you're talking 50 bucks right now, sub 50 bucks with the coupon code or 60 bucks full price. I think this is a great option. Like I said, super responsive. I mean, I'm really, really impressed. I'm gonna update the third firmware on this. So if you guys wanna check me out on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, I'm always leaving updates on technology that I unbox or that I'm reviewing. So you can check me out there and I'll give you guys updates. But that's gonna be it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, you can hit the thumbs up down below. If you have to subscribe, you can do that down there as well. And uh, I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.